So our new Teleport app allows any e-commerce platform to be plugged into our giant 3D print farm. So today we're gonna to go through the common questions that we have around this 3D printing app so that you can see how it can help you in your business and make sure it's actually covering what you need it to cover. So question number one, how fast do you ship? The Teleport app allows us to print and ship items for you. So as soon as an order comes in from the app, from your e-commerce store, we are able to print it and ship it directly to your customer for you. It is 3D print on demand drop shipping. But how long does it take us to actually go through that process? Well, generally right now, our average shipping time is about two to three days. That can extend during peak periods during Christmas where it goes up to a maximum of five business days for an item to be printed and shipped out the door. Then you have the shipping time on top of that. So if you're looking at about two days for the item to be printed and boxed up and thrown out the door, then you're looking at somewhere between two and four days for actual delivery. So it can be up to a week until you get your order, but it will generally ship in an average of about two days, and then you have the actual shipping time over the top of it. We ship via low cost methods. So UPS ground, first class, priority mail. So the actual shipping time will vary depending on the size of your item because it's based on how large it is. But generally processing time for the printing is about two days and then actual shipping time is on top of that. Can you do multiple parts to a product? Yes, you absolutely can. This is new to the Teleport app. You are able to match multiple different files to a single product. So if you are selling a lamp to people, you would upload the shade and you would upload the base and the base could be printed in black and the shade could be printed in white. And then both of those files are matched to that single product so that you can have multi-color parts, multi-part parts, all of that can be done with that single print. It also is very useful because now you no longer have to combine STLs into a single build plate volume, which is actually more efficient and more reliable. You often end up getting better quality prints because you don't have like the seam lines of the nozzle having to move outside of the print, travel to another little part of the bed, travel to another little part of the bed, travel to another little part of the bed. So it is recommended that you upload individual files for all the pieces inside of your part. And it can be anywhere from one piece to a hundred pieces. We really don't care. Might adjust your production time a little bit, but still it will always stay underneath those five days even if you have a hundred parts in a single part print. Do you ship internationally? Yes, we do ship internationally. Uh, as soon as a product is ordered, uh, uh, people have the option of using USPS international shipping. Uh, generally costs about 20 to $25 for international shipping. Uh, you do need to make sure that the purchaser pays, uh, does not pay VAT tax at the purchase because they will potentially have to pay VAT tax at import. But yes, we absolutely ship internationally. The rules around VAT and import fees and that kind of stuff vary by country. Um, but again, it is kind of the onus of the recipient to take care of those. What is the cost of 3D printing with Slant 3D? It depends on your part. But the good news is as soon as you upload a 3D model, it is instantaneously quoted. And that is the cost of printing. The cost of printing is the cost to turn it into a plastic part out of thin air and put it inside of a box. The cost of the label, the shipping cost is billed on top of that at the time of shipping. Because again, if it's shipping down the street, it might cost $2. If you're shipping around the world, it might cost $25. So shipping can't be quoted right off the top, but the cost of the print itself is quoted as soon as you upload it. It's processed immediately. Can I do multicolor parts? We do not do multicolor in the same file. So you can't have like a black part with white eyes or something like that. This piece over here can be green, this piece over here can be black, but the same piece cannot have multiple colors. That's not very scalable, and when we're producing thousands of parts for thousands of customers, we want to make sure our process is as refined and reliable as possible, and multicolor is not very reliable. Can I change print settings? No, you cannot yet change print settings. Our default print settings are 0.2 layer height with a 25% infill with support enabled. There is no brand, there's no other type of platform adhesion. The base platform is a textured PEI build plate. Those are the baseline settings of it. At this moment, you're not able to rejigger any of those settings, but those create a setting that is reliable enough to both be very robust, but still maintaining affordability and maintaining production lead time and that kind of thing. What are the quality of the prints? So the quality of the prints, again, goes back to that setting, 0.2 layer resolution, 25% uh, infill. The, the parts themselves are produced on a machine that would generally be considered equivalent to like a Bamboo Lab or Mark Forge and that kind of stuff. We use our internal 3D printers for this, but this actually also leads into the follow-up of what is the QC process for parts. When a part comes off the machine, it is put in a bin that is re reserved for that order that's coming off. 
As that part comes out, it is inspected by the technician who removes it from the machine. It then goes to the post-processing area where a technician will review it under lights and look for any imperfections or problems like, oh, this machine is jamming and it's extruding right there, or the top didn't finish, or there's warp on the bottom, those types of things. They will remove support, they will get rid of any wisps. All those basic QC things are done on each and every single part as it goes through. This maintains a very high level of quality control, but unfortunately, not every single part will be perfect. We are imperfect beings and there are humans inspecting this stuff. If a part is incorrectly shipped, it, we will refund it immediately or ship a replacement, either one of those. What colors are available? Uh, there are more colors being added all the time, but at the time of this filming, you have matte black, regular black, white, gray, red, yellow, and then you have black pet G and white pet G. But like I say, more colors and more materials being added all the time, so probably by the time you're watching this, that might be out of date. Can I order samples? Uh, yes, you can order samples. We have a prototyper app where you can uh, upload any one of your models and we will print it and ship it to you. Uh, the other option is you can um, just order an item from yourself and that way you can see the entire process and see tracking propagate through and everything else and make sure that we're doing what we say we're doing and all of that. Why wouldn't I build my own print farm? This is a perfectly reasonable question. Like if you're producing a part, why would you pay us to produce the part for you if you can do it at your own print time farm? The main reason our users use us is because it's a huge time savings for them because they don't have to refill filament, pack boxes, fix machines, know what machine is good right now, change out nozzles, troubleshoot machines. Uh, did I mention fixing and troubleshooting machines? Generally, the operations of running a factory are more than what many people realize. Now, if you're a hobbyist and you, your time is free and you're doing it for fun, then it's probably better for you to do it yourself. But if you're trying to scale up your business, it's really important to focus on customer support and design of better products, not the actual making of the products themselves. Verify us, make sure that we're making parts to your spec, but make sure that you're setting up a business that is actually allows you to operate and scale. The other thing is the scale. You may have 10 machines, but we have a thousand machines. Our main factory is spec'd out for 3000 machines. So during surge times, we're able to flex up more capacity and ramp it down without having dead machines on the time. So we're able to be very efficient and you're able to benefit from those cost savings and you don't have to worry about having a print farm that's oversized most of the time, but big enough for when you have surges. So the reasons for using us are largely scale and just ease of use. You also don't have to learn about shipping, you don't have to find boxes, you don't have to pack stuff up, and also you don't have to maintain machines. Did I mention that before? Because it turns into a thing. What print process do you use? We are FDM exclusive. We do not do resin or powder or anything else. All of our services and that kind of thing only do FDM. This makes sure it's affordable, and again, make sure that we can print and ship items really quickly for you without having to worry about dusting and cleaning and so on. What printers do you use? So we use an internally developed uh, set of printers that are um, allow us to build these giant print farms because we need a large amount of automation and that kind of thing. And there aren't machines off the shelf that can work in the type of scale that we're dealing with. But generally, if you're comparing our machines, the, our version 17 machines are basically comparable to a uh, modern Prusa Mark IV or like Bamboo Lab and that kind of stuff um, as far as like print quality and that kind of thing. How long does it take to sign up? Uh, signing up and setting up the teleport plugin takes about a half hour because you need to sign up for ShipStation, connect your store to ShipStation, and then you connect teleport to ShipStation as an app inside of ShipStation. And we have two tutorials for all of this that walk you through them. That takes literally like 15 minutes to do all of this. So it's very quick to get signed up. Uh, there will be other shippers that we integrate with in the future, but uh, right now it takes about 15 to 25 minutes or so to get signed up. And again, we have full walkthroughs of this all on slantpod.com. So you don't have to worry about getting lost in the weeds. But yeah, you set up ShipStation, connect your store to that, and then you connect uh, our, the teleport plugin to ShipStation. This allows us to work with all the partners that ShipStation works with while only having to work with them directly. So we have really good, reliable contact and information and a good partnership there. What is the packaging? The packaging for every order is a cardboard box, clear plastic tape, and the Slant 3D logo on the side. There's not currently the option for custom labels or anything like that, but it's a very basic sort of box. 
Uh, parts inside are placed into plastic bags and then are given paper damping to make sure that they don't run into each other and scrape around. So that is the basic packaging that goes into each box with, of course, a packing slip. What is the return policy? So the return policy is if we ship a part that arrives to the customer that is out of spec, i.e. It, it's warped or it broke in shipping or the print quality is bad because like skip lines or something obvious like that kind of stuff, then we will either refund the order entirely or we will uh, reship a replacement right away at our own expense, of course, for free. With all of this, contact us at info at slant3d.com if you have any issues. There are also contact forms inside of the plugin itself so that you can let us know if there are any issues at all. And literally do any sort of friction at all we want to hear about from everybody. So please do communicate that. But yeah, if we mess up, we, we eat it. And that's our fault and we will take care of it for sure. Why is Slant 3D better than other services? Well, there's not really any other services. We are the only 3D printing service that integrates with every single e-commerce platform across the planet. There's not really anybody else to go to. The ones that are closest kind of have something with Shopify, but they're really expensive and really slow. Like our service ships in like two days on average. There is no other, every other service uses like overseas print farms or printers. So they take like three weeks to get the parts and that kind of stuff. So we're, we're closer, we're faster, we work with way more platforms, and we actually have a large scale facility that's able to scale up with what your expectations for your business are. So we just have the whole package here and there's no one else who comes even close because you can hire an independent print farm that can do some orders for you, but then they will get behind as you scale up. Um, you don't have any set, um, obligations or qualifications or expectations that they have to meet because they can leave you whenever we have to continue to exist. We're very publicly doing this. So it's, it's, we have are held more accountable than almost any other service that's out there because we just have to be. Um, but yeah, we work with more platforms. We're way more accountable. We're way bigger and we are able to ship way faster than anybody else who's done a service similarly. So we try to do a good job and we're doing a better job than almost everybody else at a very basic level. So that's the reason to use us. We've just built an exceptional system that has never existed before. Uh, so we're really excited about what it will enable everybody to do because now a kid in a dorm room can design some object and then sell a million of them tomorrow and they never have to build a factory. And that's just very exciting. All right, I think that is all of the product questions that have come up. Uh, let us know down in the comments if there's other questions that you have. This should cover everything about the new Slant 3D Teleport app. You, again, you can check out all tutorials, all information and that kind of thing over at slantpod.com and try out the, the Teleport app. It's really cool. You can put your Shopify, your Etsy and your Amazon and your TikTok shop all together in one place and have somebody else do the printing and shipping for you. It's pretty cool. Have a great day, everybody.